guys welcome back to my channel and I'm doing something a little different today I'm talking about Sephora play subscription box which my two favorite subscription boxes right now are Owl Crate and Sephora play which I haven't gotten my Owl Crate yet but I'm very excited about it but today we are talking about Sephora play so this is the first thing whenever you open the box you get the theme and of course you get this little card that you can take to the store and they can show you how to use the products and give you a little tutorial on all of them. The theme this month was party goers. But pretty much this whole thing folds out and it tells you all the products which I won't show you. They always give you a nice little bag. So this is the first black bag that we've gotten. The rest have been really pretty white ones. Um, this one is the Glow Getter. Lipstick and chill. Mm, lipstick. So I love these for on the go. I can put makeup in here. I can put bobby pins and ponytail holders in here. I just like these for travel, um, but eventually I'm gonna have tons because I love this subscription box, but I'm ready to get in here. So this says, I take the party with me. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, all right, okay. So the first thing I see is the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray, which I've never tried and I've wanted to try it. Of course, people rave about it on the beauty channels. Um, but it comes with a little sample. Of course, I'm going to try it out. I mean, I'm going to do it right now. Why don't I just do it right now, you know? Oh, come on, little. Why is she going? There we go. Okay. All right. Good sample size. Great product. Very excited about this. Next thing I see, Sephora Cream Lip Stain Sample, which I have the pink one on right now. So I have a pink and a mauve, and I love both of them. They stay on all day. So this comes with shade always red and it comes with a little guy look at little look how little I just can't get over how little it is but this is I know that they have a new collection of colors that just came out um, these aren't all of them I know that they have like teals and purples and so these are a great product and honestly if you haven't tried a liquid lipstick obviously you have like Kat Von D Anastasia Beverly Hills dose color pop you have so many different options of liquid lipstick but I would try the Sephora brand because it's $14 and they're great um, I don't have any complaints with them yes they do dry your lips out a little bit but as long as you do a lip scrub before and you hydrate at night your lips will be fine and they last all day I just recommend them liquid lips are my life you either like lipstick or you like liquid lips I am definitely a liquid lipstick kind of girl now I see that we have a Lancome Mascara Excessive Black Noir. It's got like a little bit of a spiral so you can like spiral it up. But with my eyelash extensions, I don't normally use mascara on my top lashes, just on the bottom. This might be a good mascara to use on my bottom lash and I like the small size because it's good for travel. That's why I like the sample sizes. I can just throw them with me whenever I travel. They always have moisturizers, they have masks, in there they have hair masks sometimes and I just take them with me on the go that's why I love this subscription box I don't know if I'm selling it hard enough for you I don't know next another thing I'm excited about which I found out is a fragrance by Ashley Olsen by Mary Kate Nat it's weird that they say Ashley Olsen and Mary Kate Olsen because I'm used to Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen anybody else anyone else it's Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen just saying they chose to do Ashley Olsen and Mary Kate Olsen I don't know but I have heard amazing things about Elizabeth and James Nirvana rose perfume and I would say I have smelled this before oh and my phone where are you going okay we're back my phone I guess my phone was just done filming I would say it has a nice masculine scent with a floral undertone if that makes any sense last box we got a sample of Stella McCartney's pop which I love that so I may have to pick that up too I don't know if I love this as much as Stella McCartney's pop but it's still pretty good I like it it seems like a good it would be a good work scent because you know I could still you know be tough and then a little feminine mixed in there I don't know oh here's the picture of the bottle boom right there next we have makeup forever step one equalizing primer which I know that they have many steps other primers they have an oil based one they have a moisturizing one so this one is an equalizer which what I I would assume would equalize your skin so there's that but I have wanted to try these primers out before. Um, I tend to be 
more normal skin, but I get really dry in the winter, so I like moisturizing primers. But, you know, who doesn't want their skin to look even? I don't know. Isn't that like the name of the game? Isn't that what we want? So lastly, we have Detox Dry Shampoo by Dry Bar. I'm happy this is in the box because I have wanted to try it. I don't know what the price tag is for a dry bar dry shampoo. I'm sure it's great. I just don't know if I want to pay $20 for dry shampoo when Batiste is $4 and it works just fine for me. If you go to Marshalls, it's $4. Target, it's $5.99 or $6 or $7. Find it at Marshalls or TJ Maxx where you get it. The scent is not overpowering. It's actually pretty nice. We had the dry shampoo, the Lancome Mascara, um, Elizabeth and James Nirvana Perfume Sample, the Sephora Cream Lip Stain Sample, the Urban Decay All Nighter, which I'm very excited about, and Makeup Forever Step 1 Primer. So, I am very happy with this box. The box, you did good. You did good box. Every month, I've loved it. Um, they come with really great moisturizer samples that I have now ended up buying the full size of it because I just love it so much. Samples you can take and go whenever you travel. You can throw things like this in your purse and go. What is it, like $10.98 a month for these samples? Like, come on. What? Like, you should do it if you love makeup or you want to explore makeup. Like, we can chat makeup in the comment section because I do love makeup and I love being abreast of the new makeup products. Um, I'm trying to broaden my vocabulary, y'all. I don't even say y'all. I'm trying to broaden my vocabulary since I always say excited and cute. I'll get over it someday, maybe. I'm excited to get over it because it's not cute. And who doesn't love Sephora? I freaking love Sephora. I accidentally am a VIB at Sephora. It's fine. I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. I know this isn't about books, but books and makeup are two of my favorite things. And I thought I would share the Sephora Play because it's a great subscription box. I'm gonna sell you even more. Sell you even more. But anyway, I'm done filming. I filmed a few videos now and I'm losing my mind. Please hit the subscribe button if you like my videos. Comment down below. I love having conversations with you guys. Thanks for watching this and I hope you have a great weekend.